In Yanka Programming, you can create simple control programs using flowcharts. First, drag one of the human characters onto the screen. Each character can perform around 50 different actions. Some actions make the character turn to the side or to the front. Some, known as travelling actions, change its position. Others, like the non-travelling ones, finish in the same position as they started. The best way to control the characters is by creating a program using the flowchart commands. Every flowchart begins with one of the start commands, so drag the start onto the screen. When your program is ready, you'll use the green button to run it. You can click on the name of the flowchart and type a new name. Flowchart commands can easily be moved around the screen. Just click on the command and drag it to its new position. Next, we need to tell a character what to do. This is done using action commands from the inputs and outputs folder. Snap the action commands to the bottom of the flowchart and a black square appears when a connection is made. The action commands automatically link to the character on screen. To choose an action, click on the word action on the flowchart and choose an action from the list. Some actions let you specify how many times they run or the direction in which to move. Finally, you need to complete the flowchart. Either add a stop command or make a loop as we're doing here. Click once at the bottom of the last element and move the mouse to draw a connection. To make a bend, click again while you're drawing the connection. To finish it, move it to another part of the flowchart and click when you see a black square appear. Now you can run the program by clicking the green arrow. To change the actions, click on the action name and choose a new one. This can be done while the program is running and any changes will automatically be shown. To stop the program running, click on the blue square.